Hi, my name is Mr. Che, and I will be your teacher for uh, Track C or the following term. And I hope that, um, yeah, we have a good time. Uh, please ask questions whenever um, you need to, and I will get back to you as soon as I can, okay? Um, I wanted to make a video on how to uh, turn in work because I know that we're in a new learning management system or LMS and uh, it can get kind of difficult. So um, I'm gonna share my screen a few times and then I'm gonna be clicking all the way around a little bit. So hang on, hang in there with me as I do all this stuff, okay? All right, so uh, one thing I want you want to emphasize is please ignore those HTML, file, HTML files that are in a lot of the assignments. Um, I'm gonna phase them out, but uh, yeah, they may just be distracting or they may kind of confuse you, but please ignore those. What I mean by that is, let's say you have an assignment here. This is the bulk of the assignment. This is all you need to know. There may be an attachment right here on the bottom. Just ignore that, okay? This was here uh, because I needed to, it's, it kind of helped me um, copy and paste what the assignment was from our previous learning management system. And so just ignore this when you, when you get going to assignments, just focus on this link and these five steps, okay? The next thing is um, before we were able, you were able to take a picture, upload it onto your computer and attach your image or your document directly from your computer into um, the learning management, into the assignment. This time around with our new, with Brightspace, you're not gonna be able to do that, okay? Um, you're gonna have to upload all your documents onto Google Docs. And then from there, you're gonna have to either create a link or connect um, the Google Doc into, uh, into Brightspace. And I will go over how to do that, okay? So in Google Docs, you're gonna have to create a folder. You're gonna upload that assignment into your folder, okay? And then make sure you're able to share that document with me, and here's my email address, okay? You also may wanna um, look into this handy um, program called Cami, okay? And this will help you save paper. You can write directly on the electronic um, file, and you, don't, you will not have to uh, use paper or pen when doing these problems, okay? And let me show you an example of how to do this, okay? So I'm gonna open my Google Drive and here's my Google Drive, okay? And what I'm gonna do is first of all, I'm gonna create a new folder. So you, you go into Google Drive and then click on new and here's the folder, okay? I'm gonna title it sample folder, okay? I'm, I'm just gonna title it, but you should probably title your class with that, okay? So create that, okay? And it's gonna show up right here. I would open it here. Okay, and then what I would do is I would, um, then any document that you have in your computer, you could upload it. So file upload, and let's just say I upload um, any image here. I'm gonna upload, I don't know, this Q2 thing, okay? All right, this Q2, this is the image that I just have in my computer, okay? So I upload it and it's in here, okay? So this Q2 should be in here. Once you do that, you should open it. Okay, uh, share settings. Okay, and your settings should be, my name should be here. Or what you could simply do is go click here and then go to iLead Online and it's anyone with a link, okay? And once you do that, you can copy the link, okay? And then go into the area where you could submit and then you could submit the link right here when you turn in an assignment, okay? So you could go URL, okay? Also, you, could, you can also um, um, do it through Google Drive. And let me show you how to do that real quick. Okay, so you could do it through Google Drive here. And when you do Google file embed, and when you do that, they're gonna ask you which Google Drive you're gonna look for. Okay, you're gonna switch accounts and 
uh, go to the account that you're in. So I'm thinking it's your iLead one here. Okay. Your iLead one is there and you should be in as recent pretty much. And you should be able to click on this link, attach it. Okay, and it should work from there. Okay, and then they'll embed it for you. And this document will come, I will be able to see this document when you, and you insert it. And then just press that submit button when you are finished. Okay, so that is how you turn in work. All right. The other um, thing you may want to look into is this uh, program called Cami. And Cam, what Cami does, it uh, helps you uh, write on the electronic file. Okay. And so um, this may be a good time to invest in like that electronic pencil. Okay. And so you could open any document from either the Google Drive, OneDrive, you know, so on and so forth. Let's just say, I do it from my Google Drive, okay? And what this will do is, let me actually, yeah, OneDrive. And what this will do is on Lady Online. So if you open from your Google Drive, because, and by the way, all the documents that are, all the links that are in, um, at least the worksheets, uh, they're all in Google Drive as well. We uploaded them all on Google Drive. Okay, so they're directing, all right, let's see here, where'd it go? Well, let's just say we upload it from our computer, okay? I, let's, say, let's say I check, let's do, a, let's do a Q4. And I convert it. Okay, it converts it, it does everything for you, so on and so forth, and here is the document. Okay, and here's a problem, all right? And so what I'm gonna do is with the pencil, I'm not using a pencil right now, but what you can with the pencil, you could identify the corresponding part. So in this case, the P and the S corresponds with the F and the K. So P, S corresponds with F and K, right? Okay, and when the P, S corresponds with the F, K, what, what happened that, and you, again, look at how I wrote this out on this document right here, okay? Then after that, you would download with annotations and then begin the export, okay? Once you download it here, again, you could go to your Google Drive here. Let's go back, go to your Google Drive. You could put it in your file, right? And you're gonna do the same thing what we did before, okay? You're gonna go into the assignment, all right? Um, embed, you're gonna be able to embed it, okay? Through uh, the Google file embed, they're gonna ask for you, your account, and you go from there. So you're doing that same cycle over and over again, okay? I hope this video helped. Um, if you're having trouble navigating through um, Brightspace, uh, please let me know. Um, also, with I will try to email you back as soon as possible. I have a 24-hour window. Um, also, you can send me messages on Remind. Uh, feel free to do that anytime. Uh, yeah, so um, please let me know, again, if you need any help. This is a transition. Please, I, I just ask for your patience. I know this was going to be kind of difficult for some of you. Um, but you know, we'll get to this together, okay? All right, have a good day.